Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome to Supreme Commander Forged Alliance. My name of course is Obra Potato. This is a game that I jumped into on Forged Alliance forever, and I want to make this absolutely clear. I have almost zero comprehension. Well, not zero comprehension. That's a little bit of an exaggeration there. Uh, but, you know, I, I don't really I don't really understand, you know, what's going on as much as uh, some of the pros. So I thought, you know what, if me and Brink are going to be doing some more collabs and potentially some casts and whatnot... Then, uh, then I would really like to get at least a little bit decent at this game, so uh, so I can at least sort of you know fend for myself in the Forged Alliance world. So, okay, stop, stop there, and I can just get you to build from there because you're within the build range. That's right, working like a pro already. All right, so yeah, that's uh, that's pretty much what I'm doing. I'm gonna gonna give it a try, see if I can uh, understand things a little bit better, if I can. Fingers crossed. Uh, move a little bit more forward for me, please, buddy. Thank you. I appreciate it. Uh, yeah, basically, I am just going to try my absolute very best not to die. I would expect to die very, very, very soon um, because I'm terrible at the game and everybody else is much better than me. But apart from that, uh, I think I stand a, a sort of good chance of, of understanding a little bit more of uh, of what's going on. By the way, my name is Over the Potato. I hope you uh, I hope you know that. I hope I said it. I hope I mentioned it. Uh, I I can't really remember if I did. All right, you guys need to help this guy. People were commenting a lot last time, and I really really appreciate it. So keep keep commenting on on the videos because I really want to know you know what is going on. Also, red is a is a hideous color. I much prefer, I much 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 prefer, uh, you know, my my traditional orange. But you know what? I will I will settle for uh, settle for red right now. All right, let's get some units out. I know we're gonna get absolutely wrecked very very soon anyway. So I'm honestly not that bothered about anything, to be honest. Um, yeah, I'm fairly certain. Can I just can I get you to pick this up, please? How do I? There you go. Do some, do some reclaiming. All right, great. All right. So I, I, I have literally no idea about what's a, what's a good unit and what is not a good unit. But you know what? We're gonna give it our, our damned best shot to see if we can try and get something that's you know semi decent going on here. All right. Let's get that. Let's get a, another mass extractor up there. Hopefully that's going to bring us to just enough mass to produce two factories constantly. While you're over here, you can go and build a, another mass generator. And after you've done that, oh no, we're going to have to send some some engineers down to do the hydrocarbon plant. It's a hydrocarbon plant? I think it's a hydrocarbon power plant. Awesome. Great. So we've got a little force building up. Um, again, as you can probably tell, I'm not holding out much hope. I'm not honestly holding out much hope at all. This guy is like amazing. He's like 1,400. That's like brink level good. So if I can, if I can withhold for a little bit, then, uh, you know, that is something that I am okay with. All right. In fact, you know what? No, let's let everybody stay back here. We want to do some scouting. I have no idea where he is. So you go that way. You go up there. Perfect. Everybody's busy doing different things. Commander, I want you to keep on reclaiming, buddy. Can you reclaim? Is that stuff that you can reclaim? I don't really know. In all honesty, I have no real idea. Alright, so you've scouted me, clearly. That worries me a lot. Uh, this is something that we can reclaim, which is really nice, actually. Uh, we need to make sure that we actually go air, because otherwise we're going to be in trouble. And we also need to make sure that we get some... Oh, fuck. Fuck. Okay, that's basically all of my engineers absolutely gone. Uh, let's build... Anti-air there, I guess. Just to make sure that we're not completely screwed. Although we are completely screwed. Uh, Alright, so something's going on up there. I don't know what it is, but something is going on up here. So I guess we just keep on pumping out units and pretend that we are... Pretend that we know exactly what's going on. Whereas we don't actually know what's going on. Finish building this anti-air turret, please, today. Please quickly. Please quickly. Please quickly. Don't build so many labs. I have no idea what he's talking about. What the heck is a lab? Is this a lab? A land factory? 
They are not filled. They are not cost efficient in battle. Oh, thank you. Oh, damn it. He's uh, he's killing me. Uh, what what should I say? Sorry. New to game. New to game. There we go. All right. Let's let's pretend that I'm not a complete idiot. All right. Don't don't do that. All right. Go go here. Build me an anti-air turret. I hope he doesn't rage at me. I think he might rage at me. They're not cost efficient in battle. Well, you know what? Every every stage is is good. All right, commander, you finished the hydrocarbon plant. That's great news. <laughs> Guessed so. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. Well, you know what? No, I'm not sorry. Did you see some tutorials? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Not. <laughs> yeah, yeah, man. Some. All right, let's go for let's go for that. Yeah, man. Some. Something like that. All right. Should we go naval? I feel like a, g a good transition right now would be naval. But first, let's get a uh, let's get a radar so we actually can see uh, see what's going on a little bit. You can build an air factory. That's great. All right, radar is up and running. We've got some stuff coming in there. Let's build another anti-air turret just to make sure. And I guess we probably go for tier two if nobody else is doing anything busy. Then let's just just go for tier two. And they didn't say to Max, and they didn't say to Max build three labs in the game. I have no idea what he's on about, mate. Are these are these labs land light assault bots? Uh, perhaps I don't know. I really don't know. I have no idea what he's even talking about. But I suppose this is just going to be a really easy game for him. So. He's got really nothing to worry about. I'm going to try and jump straight to Tech 2 Air. I have no idea if that's going to be a successful measure or an unsuccessful measure. Uh, but whatever the case, uh, let's get these units to come down here and cut off the dude. All right. Point defense there. Tech 1 point defense. And then we want to queue up some concrete wall around it. Because apparently that's the thing that the pros do. So in all honesty, I'm going to do it. All right come down this way tech one light tank okay so light tanks seem to be the thing that uh, that people are doing all right well now my economy is absolutely fucked let me turn off the radar save a little bit of power that makes pretty much no difference um medium tank mobile anti-aircraft gun i don't really want a mobile anti-aircraft gun what do i want i want some light artillery that seemed to be pretty good people were were singing the praises of that in the uh, in the last video well, I'm, I'm fucked anyway. Hopefully this gets done fairly soon to save me a little bit of grief. That would be nice. But that means very little. My economy is still starved of mass. It's got a little bit of energy right now. But, uh, but yeah. I wouldn't hold out uh, too much hope for me here, boys, unfortunately. I would not hold out too much hope. You see, they just get slaughtered. Yeah. All right, there we go. Yeah, sad face. That's a shame. All right. Okay, engineers need to get back like yesterday. Very important that they get back. All right. What can we do? We need some amphibious tank, mobile missile launcher, heavy tanks. Let's get some... Uh, I don't think... Heavy tanks? Heavy tanks. Build me heavy tanks. Right now. Okay. Fingers crossed our Tech 1 defense will uh, will save us a little bit. But, again, I'm not holding out much hope. Alright, let's get some fighter bombers. That's going to absolutely kill our economy, as as it usually does. Heavy tanks are now coming out. That's, that's somewhat nice. Engineers, it's very important that we don't let them die, because there are only two engineers on the entire board. Okay, so go that way. Swing that off. Go this way. Come on. Come on. Come on, don't die, don't die, don't die. It's very important that these engineers do not die. We need them. We need them urgently. Alright. Where are my heavy tanks? Heavy tanks need to come down here too. Alright. Okay, well, we've got forces up there. We've got forces down here. We're basically... What? You gotta expand faster. Yeah, I know. I really needed to be way more aggressive than I actually was, which is... Uh, a little bit of a shame, but that's all right. You know what? That's okay. Heavy tank, mobile artillery. Got two heavy tanks. I'm okay with this. What's the engagement range of the artillery? We might as well try and... I don't want to get into hit to the engagement range of him. 
And also with ACU. Yeah, man, I know. Alright, let's try and engage his... Let's try and engage his, his ACU. Alright, let's build some power storage. So that we can... Alright, you need to help with this, buddy. We need some, some more stuff. And the fighter bombers will hopefully help uh, with the economy a little bit. Hopefully help with the economy, hopefully help with the defense a little bit. Uh, but again, I'm not holding out much hope. I've got basically nothing. He's got defenses pretty much everywhere. We're basically screwed at this point. I mean, I don't know what the manners are in this game. Is it just like GG, just GG early? I mean, I don't really know, but I'm basically fucked. So I guess expansion really is, uh, is, is key at the beginning. There's no point in unnecessarily um, putting our, our tanks into harm's way. That just seems a little bit daft. Alright, let's hope that this point defense gets finished. Mobile light artillery. Yeah, let's move that up there. You guys can come up here. We need to get some point defense down. And then afterward... No, you and you. After the point defense goes down, we want to build some wall sections. Okay, great. As you can see, I've probably made about pretty much every rookie mistake you ever could. Uh, in all honesty. And I have literally zero regrets. Literally zero regrets. I've got a fighter. Oh, in fact, you know what? Let's, let's take this opportunity to absolutely fuck up his shit. Oh, look. His ACU's down here. Oh, that's epic. Oh, sweet. Okay, well... I guess we can try and fuck up his ACU. That's about all I got. Well, we're attacking his commander as well, but... We can do absolutely nothing because we're shit at the game. We've got no skills. We ain't got no skills to pay the bills. So it looks like that that is going to be my uh, my my first game of, of, of Supreme Commander Forged Alliance. But you know what? I think it's a learning process, isn't it? It's it's absolutely a learning process. You you can't you can't expect to be great at the game all at once. You know it takes practice, and uh, and practice is something that I'm willing to do. I mean, this guy hasn't even has he even gone up to tech two? I don't even know if he has. You know that's that really shows you how how awesome it is that you know people can can be amazingly good on tech one, and it shows how very little I actually know. How very little I actually know, but you know, again, it's uh, it's all about continual improvement. GG to you two. G G G. There we go. Unfortunately, you know, I was I was matched up against somebody that was uh, fairly fairly good. I mean, look at this. Look at this. This is just very very impressive. Um, so clearly, I've got a lot to learn. He has a lot of bases and whatnot, so a lot of land factories even, should I say. He's, he clearly expanded very, very fast. Did he even go up to Tech 2? He did go up to Tech 2. Wow. That is, that is impressive. Power spamming all the way. So, you know, please comment. Please help me understand where I went wrong. I need to know uh, if I'm to stand any chance in the future. Obviously, the game is still uh, understanding how bad I am, so uh, it'll, it'll need to calibrate a score for me, but there we go. Uh, I appreciate all of the comments that people left in the last video telling me about builders and whatnot. Yeah, I know I know what a build order is and 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 stuff like that. But uh, but yeah, it's it's always good to to have you know to to have something to improve upon. And uh, you know I I intend to continue improving uh, throughout my. Uh, my my playing of Supreme Commander Forged Alliance, but unfortunately that's going to be it for today. Very very short episode because uh, because I'm a very very bad player. But hopefully we'll improve with time, and you know together we can bring me up from the ashes of defeat into a sparkling Forged Alliance Phoenix. And hopefully you'll be with you, you. You'll be with you. Hopefully you'll be with me for the journey, ladies and gentlemen. My name, of course, has been Obadiah Potato. Thank you very, very much for watching that terrible, terrible game of Forged Alliance. And hopefully I'll see you next time.